you know, I'm going to go all over the place here. Um, so anyway, I'm just going, oh, you want me to start when the red thing comes on? See, so the TV camera doesn't bother me. Because I'm always on the camera or radio or what have you. Wow, that's great. No, start anytime you want. Go ahead and start talking. Is it the red button just flashing? Yeah, that's right. It's on. Oh, all right. I'm Mike Boyce, the Parks and Recreation Director for the Town of Bailiville. I'm also the Station Manager for Baycat Television, uh, Public Access, Community Access TV. The Baycat stands for Bailiville Community Access Television. We call it Baycat. All right. It is a, uh, I've been here as a Recreation Director for almost 20 years, and I've been doing this for about seven, eight years. I got involved because I thought it was a, uh, a gold mine for the community, basically. Um, again, when we started negotiating the contract, uh, with Adelphia, at the time it was Frontier Vision, the contract uh, was going to be up. So I says, wow, this is a perfect opportunity because I talked with other uh, recreation professionals throughout the state and New England. All right? And they said, wow, we ought to get on the ground floor. So that's how I got involved in it. Initially, it was in the contract negotiations. And everything stemmed from there, from the contract negotiations. I made contacts, found out about a lot of things. Also, because of my position as a Parks and Recreation Director, I thought, what a perfect opportunity to promote my programs in the community to let people know what's going on everywhere, okay? And instead of just putting it in the um, newspaper or what have you, use a television medium also, all right? So that's how it transpired, and then things grew bigger from there, okay? I got this uh, station manager position actually by default, all right? No one else at the time seemed to be really, really interested except for private business and, and things like that. So that's how everything transpired from there. Uh, I also run all my programs. I tape a lot of my programs uh, and put them out across the airwaves. This weekend I have a basketball tournament and we'll be taping a lot of the, the Woodland kids' games, taping them, and then we'll be airing them almost on the same night. Tomorrow some games we'll be taping them on Saturday. Taping them on Saturday and Saturday night they will be aired so the kids can see themselves that night. And on Sunday, we'll take and put them on on Sunday night. Okay. Um, here is a lot of the equipment that we have. Um, believe me, we did not start out with all this equipment right from the get-go. All right. Started out very, very small, and things have progressed. The what we do here is we have a, an incoming line and an outgoing line, so that I know what's going across the air at all times on uh, Channel 10, Baycat Television. Okay, we got the in and out lines right here. They come in through. All right. So what we do is I explain everything. This is just a regular TV, just like it is right at your own home. All right. That's it's on channel 10, so I can watch it 24 hours a day. Okay. So I know what's going across the air and what the consumer is watching. Okay. I'll show it. See, that's another station. See, just okay. Within. So I'm back to 10. Okay. So I know what my station looks like as compared to other stations. So if there's a problem, I can know it's my station or it's across the cable company. Okay? All right. Here's my monitor. It's what I can watch to when everything is going to be played. Okay? Look. So it's the same thing. So you notice there is a color difference. This is pure. Okay? The color is pure. As it goes across the lines, you do lose something. Okay? That's how we are not high definition. We are digital. High definition, you don't lose your colors or any of that. That's the big advantage of high definition. We're not there yet. We are digital. Okay? All right? So, therefore, is the change. Now, with this, I can get tapes ready. In other words, what they have headers. A lot of them will have headers on them. Let me get tape out. Okay? This is uh, Navy Marine Corps News. This is a VHS tape, free of charge from the government. Free of charge, okay? I can put it in. I press a button here, right? Still going across the air of the crawl line, what we call the crawl line, okay? Now you see the header? Therefore, I don't have to put the header on. The people don't want to watch that. They could care less, okay? Mm -hmm. So now I could, okay? Now I could speed it up. To wherever it is. Okay, promo. Okay, stop. Okay, now, this is ready to play across the air. Okay, therefore the people don't have to see it. I can put it across the air at any time. Okay, all I have to do is pre press a button. Okay, I can do that right now. All right? Play button. Across the air. 
just like that. Okay? That's all I have to do. I'll let that play. Doesn't matter. Okay? Simple as that. Now, I got that playing, okay? Now, what I can do at the same time, it's in the monitor. All I have to do, if I want to put something on after this, all right? Okay? On there is Army News Watch, free from the government. Okay? Here's another one. Musicians of Maine from the Mount Blue Public Access Television Station. Great. Free of charge. Okay? It's on the, uh, this is on DVD. All right? The DVD in. All right? Got to load. All right? This is our Super VHS here. We started with Super VHS and the, and the uh, character maker. Here. It's all we started out with right from the start. That's all I had outside of another camera, which is in another room. That's all I had to start out with. And what we did is we progressively grown from there from the uh, franchise fees. Okay? All right. Stop. Okay, now, these have headers too. All right? So what I can do now, all right, I can switch it over to number six. See the header on the DVD? Nothing's changed. That's still going across the air. All right? Now I can press... Play. See? Now it's going across. Now I know where that's starting. So when that program comes over, okay? There. Stopped it. So that for when that station is over, I can press this. She clicks right in. Okay? And I also can interchange between what's here and what's there. I'm just I'm going fast here, but. Alright, plan. Alright? I can interchange. We're going across the air to the consumer, like this. See? Okay? I can interchange. Okay. Just pressing the button. This is the uh, Lightrex uh, Mini T Pro. And what it is, it's an event, what they call an event controller. All right? The event controller, so if I'm not here, it can play things, especially at night, 9, 10, 11, 12 o'clock at night. It will air. It's all hooked up. But everything is all in the hook together. It will play things so I don't have to come over. All right? And check it. Yes, mechanical devices do sometimes fail. Sometimes stuff does not get on the air. Okay? Especially when you have a power outage. <laughs> okay? The problem is you might lose power, and then the power comes back on. This throws everything all off because it's built on a clock. Okay? So I'll have to come back and reset everything. Okay, I just want to let everybody know that. <laughs> you know, it's on. You no, know, it doesn't quite work that way. Okay? All right. Okay, we got the DVD. I'll just back up. Okay. I've also... This is digital. Okay, here. There's the digital tapes. Okay? The character maker. And over here are th three commercial VCRs. They can play Super VHS and regular VHS. Okay, so therefore, in the night, depending on how long the programs are, I can start at 5 and go all the way through the midnight. Okay? Up here is a stereo. Okay? What this is, it's hooked up in here. All right, I can stop it. It's going across the air. Well, I won't stop it. I'm back to our crawl line. On our crawl line, we have a dealing with... That's going across the air to the consumer. On our crawl line, I can train it up, is WQDY. See? PDY has allowed us on a crawling to have music going across at the same time in local, any local radio station. Okay? Um, so this is what this is. This is hooked up to PDY so that they're getting... So because, say if I had a snowstorm and I had to cancel an event, okay? I have to call, obviously, call just like calling off school. All right? So the kids can either listen to it on the radio and they can also watch it on Channel 10 at the same time. So I'm killing it at both ends. Okay? School events. School's canceled or anything else. High school or what have you is going across the air. Okay? Playing music and all that. Okay? Okay? I'll turn it down. Okay? This is a character maker, which is the crawl line. All right? I get things faxed to me, sent to me, dropped off. It's all the events, community between Callis, Woodland, Princeton, Bering, all community events. And what we do is we type them in and put them across the air. All right? How long does it take to do? To do? It varies, depending on how long. 
Um, I do have a, a part-time secretary I just got um, who will come in after school. She's a high school student, and when she comes by, she'll put some things on. Uh, right now, we've just got two things to put on here. Okay. Does it involve in just typing that in? Just type it in, and I'll show you. All right, let me get down. All right, see, now what's going across the consumer? Now, I could type in the character or the crawl line, and it doesn't affect anything going across the air. Okay, watch. See? Type it in. I'll go back to the beginning. See, this is still going across the air. Now I can update my crawl line. Okay? Mm -hmm. And it doesn't bother anybody. Okay? They don't see my spelling mistakes or my screw up. Okay? Right. <laughs> All right, now. Okay? See, I, so I can update this, answer the phone or what have you, and it's not affecting the person across the air. All right? Glasses on here. I'm basketball ref. I mean, blind. Okay. <laughs> okay. Big Cat, Town Baileyville, Community Access Television. Now, one of my mottos is your station for nonprofit community programming. Okay. Right there. It goes every day, 24 hours a day. This crawl line runs no matter if I have a program on TV or not. Okay. <laughs> Big Cat, program schedule. Working to bring you the largest selection of programming in the Sunrise County. Okay. A little model type thing. And then is our schedule. What's on during the that day. All right? Okay, and it goes down through. Uh, Musicians of Maine. Time Life Medical. That was stuff, things that were on last night. All about migraine, headaches, colon, rectal cancer, prostate disorders. So they know Wednesday night is what I call my medical night. Okay? And I'll explain that further too. But Thursday, which is today, Maine Woods and Waters, Northeast Journal. Okay, the Maine Woods and Waters programs and Northeast Journal, uh, free programs. It says various programs because there's so many of them. Thursday nights is our outdoor night. Okay, our outdoor community access night. So hunting, fishermen, Washington County, there's a lot of those around. Okay, so that's that night. They have bass fishing, hunting, all that stuff. I haven't updated about Friday or Saturday yet. So Obviously church, okay? People's United Methodist Church, St. James Church. Is Methodist, Catholic, uh, Bethel Chapel is Protestant, and then we have others. Uh, we have the uh, Baptists, the uh, Pentecostal, all different night, different days, Mondays and uh, Sundays and Mondays. Okay, there's the Pentecostal. So those people all know it's on once during the day, once at night. Okay, so you notice everything gets pretty much done on these church services by nine o'clock. Nine o'clock is when I'll put on some of our own programming. Okay? I'll explain that in a minute. Okay? Go back. There's about 40 pages here. Town council meeting, when the next town council meeting will be. And I air and tape all town council meetings. All right? Next meeting is uh, at school board. Air and tape all school board meetings. Okay? We have a camera. We set up a camera. We tape it. We bring it in and air it. Okay? Hospital programs. They announce about hospital programs coming up. Uh, let's see. Uh, there's all the hospital things. Oh, these are all hospital. My Now, with the rec department, my schedule. So the kids will know and the adults know. All I have to do is put on channel 10, they know what's going across the air. All right? With all my travel teams, adult exercise, aerobics, that's just weekly schedule. Okay? So I'm promoting my programs at the same time as they across the air. Okay? Uh, volleyball, all my, all my programs, Masonic meetings, and bingo, uh, Indian Township, school union budget hearings, NADA, uh, Neighbors Against uh, Drug and Alcohol Abuse meetings, uh, let's see, preschools, senior citizens, suppers, public suppers, uh, benefit suppers. These are all announced, just like a newspaper. Uh, these are free of charge. We don't have any commercials. All right. Nor do we accept. We accept donations, but we don't charge anybody. We don't uh, ask for any money. All right. This is all free to the community. All the money that we take in is through our cable access fees. All right. Bring this back. Cable access fees is a percentage of the person's uh, bill. Say if their bill was forty dollars, the town four percent of that bill. Um, what, a dollar, forty, or something like that? Okay, 
So a dollar forty out of that bill will pay for this. This is not paid through any taxpayers' money. Okay? Alright? I'll start back up. But so yeah, now it's back on. When that shit was on, it will click back to the crawl line. Okay? Question. Alright. This right here is my editing machine. Alright. Let me get into this. Yes, sometimes when we do tape. Is that from Great Northern? Yes. Okay. Excellent. All right. Let me get it ready here. I got to turn it on. All right. Now, this is an editing machine where when we do tape, we can edit out something. Okay? For obvious reasons. Or um, to make it look piecemeal. Not so piecemeal. In other words, you turn the camera on and on, on and off. This gives it a flow. Okay? Also, what happens here is that uh, when you go and edit, you can put music to something, you could uh, anything that you want, and I'll explain in a minute. What I do is a lot of these tapes are only half an hour to an hour long. All right? I want, so that I don't have to keep coming in and changing tapes. I'll fix it so I edit it in the editing machine, put everything together, put it on a digital. The digital, there are some digitals up to three hours long. So I get three hours on one of these tapes when I'm in about five of the others. So what I do is I edit it in, put it back, and put it on one of these tapes. So I have a program for the whole night, and I don't have to keep coming back and forth. Okay? So you can take the standard DV tape? Yes. I can, uh, in the DVD, digital, or VHS, any of those. Okay? The any machine's hooked up to these three. Okay? Not these three. All right? Okay? Uh, where am I here? All right, let me get... Okay, Casablanca Avia, this is my editing machine. I mean, we could be all day on this one, folks. Okay, but basically, edit. See, this is all edited. Everything is edited. I got a few things in here. They're all edited, put it together, and then, well, I could print, put it back out, all right? Put it back out to any of these others, all right? I can put it in, out, on any others. In other words, it was on uh, VHS. VHS tapes don't last very long. Okay, what I can do, download it here, put it back out, and put it on a DVD here, it'll last forever. All right, okay, therefore I don't ruin the quality of the tape. These things don't lose quality, the DVDs, okay? So it just makes it easier. And I'm also at the same time able to uh, answer the phone and everything. I mean, all this stuff, I've got a down pad that I can just work on things, okay? All right, so everything's all interchanged. This uh, stereo is hooked up so I can play music into some of the editing machines. Okay, so I can play music. Uh, say if there's, um, oh, I got coming up an Easter egg hunt. Obviously, there's not much just kids yelling and screaming. Well, I want to put music to that to make it sound, you know, professional with the kids. Okay, so put a little bit of music to it with the kids screaming. It just makes it look better, that's all. Okay, and I'll edit that in and put it back out so the kids can watch it, and watch themselves and stuff, getting, and then picture with the Easter being with the Easter Bunny and all that fun stuff. Okay? Where, does it, where does it take my... What's, you said that we, we looked at the wires over here. Yeah. The wires come in and go out. Yeah. The digital... Uh, that's the modulator. Right here's the modulator. Okay? That was put in by Adelphia. That's the actual thing that Adelphia puts in? Yes. That takes the signal out? Yes. That's the top one? Yes. What's the bottom one? Amplifier. What, they amplify the signal? Yes. Okay. And so it goes... Then, out, it goes to the head, what they call the head end. Right. The head end is where everything comes in. All right. Where all the signals, every two through 50, come in. And then they disperse it to the channels. Two through 50. Okay. All right. Uh, they have a satellites and things like that come in for, obviously, for a lot of the set up there. I don't know. Um, HBO or Cinemax or any of that stuff comes in into the head end and then they disperse it out to what channel it is. Where 10 goes in and comes back out. All right. For 10. Two, five, seven, all come in and they go out back out. Okay. And, what, and what controls, what computer do you use, what system do you use to keep your crawl line running all the time? This crawl line runs all the time. It isn't turned off. Crawl line's running all the time. The, the video title maker actually... Never shuts off. Never no, That never shuts off? No. This is running all the time. Okay. Okay? I can bring it back. Uh, what do you have up here, Mike? Your breakout boxes? Like These are the speakers so I can hear it. The music and going into the editing machine. Okay. The editing machine is just a, a computer 
basically that takes in video, but it doesn't have speakers or a monitor or anything. Okay, mm -hmm. just think of this: the anime machine is like a computer with no speakers and no monitor. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's why we have this hooked up. Okay, these are the speakers. Okay, left and right, so you get the stereo. Here is my Mini T Pro, which is pressing the signal out. Okay. All right, everything's hooked up in it, and then I can interchange between one through eight. Eight is my my crawl line, and radio. All right. Now, also, which has happened through Navy, the Navy's now gone to the computer age, where I can. On my computer, my computer's hooked up, so that I can download something from my computer, okay, and put it over here into my machines, and I can hear it. Okay. So you get it ready. So you go from your computer right into the right on the air. Yes. Really. And how much? <clears throat> How much time does it take to prepare and get all your stuff for a normal day? Depending on how much you got, huh? Depending on what I have to do during the day. I mean, you have a lot of games you put on TV. Where do you find the time for all this? Ask my wife. I don't know. Um, <clears throat> because, I mean, correct me if I'm wrong, but, like, could you give me an estimate of you did woodland? What, what did you do for basketball games this year alone? 